what's going everyone we are back with some more 20 dwarf challenge and hammer tang they had patched yesterday so i'm going to be going over the patch notes and talking about the series because it looks like it may have affected it first off i wanted to do what i had promised which was there's a couple people who wanted me to name dwarves at the, after them, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. The first one is going to be Peon. Welcome to the mine, Peon. And the second one... I find him. There he is. Four is now going to be Mr. Flibble. Mr. Flibble, welcome to the mine. Love the name. Because you don't know, Mr. Flibble is from a TV show called Red Dwarf. It's a British sci-fi comedy. Actually, probably my favorite TV show of all time. If you haven't seen it, check it out. It's really funny. It's, it goes back to the 80s. It's still current, though. They're still making, I think the last season was last year, I believe. And they're talking about making more. Anyways, going to the patch. They changed a bunch of things with this last patch. We'll go over a few of the things. First off, they've changed the menu. What it looks like. They've also changed the icon. So now the small quarry and the quarry now look different. Same with the small smithy and the regular smithy. The small foundry and the large foundry will look the same. I don't actually have this. Also, I thought I should mention, I had to revert this save back. This is from the sixth episode. You'll notice that there is no elevator right now. I'll go over that in a, few, in a little bit. They've also added some new things in here. Added long railways which are four long as opposed to the normal one long. Now they have said they are not working. They've done the same with elevator rails, which I can show you right here. I actually built, there's a single rail elevator rail. This is a four. They did the same thing. They said the same thing. The elevator rails are not working correctly right now. They have added stone stairways, which these are the stone stairways. They have added a small stone bridge, which this is the small stone bridge. And this is the small stone walking bridge, which look the same. They're just made with different materials. Small stone walking bridge is more affordable because it just uses stone where small stone bridge I don't understand why but it uses ingots that's not stone the other thing they added was a small wooden walk bridge Let's see here what else have they changed in here I think that that's all they've changed as far as adding new items don't think they've added anything else in here. The other thing they did change though was the leveling up. So now instead of leveling up their attributes, they now have talent trees. So you have tiers one through five. You have to get certain talents in order to go down to the next tier, pick the same thing. So in order to get so we'll just go over them all. So power of observation, this gives awareness plus two, vision plus three, experience three percent. Maximum health for uh rugged mindset gives them a hundred extra health. Splunker Scout gives movement speed fifteen percent. And then for farmers, it's it is also levels up the difference. So wisdom and robustness. This one's deafness and awareness, robustness plus one. In order to get to tier two, so you have apprentice stonemason, you get plus three to stonemason level, but you need to have, as you can see right above it, power of observation and complex stonemasonry, mountain home requirement. Oh, we have to have the talent, the talent up here for it. 
So you have to, you'll see it's highlighted in red. So for Dwarf Mara, which adds awareness and fever, you need to have these two here, Cave Herbalism. Same thing, you know, we'll go through these all instead of showing you. You can see they turn red up there, though. Tells you the personal requirements underneath. So you need Yeoman Farmer. But for this one, it's uh, plus one to farming and plus three to healing. This one gives Ar Arcanus, Arcanist level one. This is Master of Mines. Slime Eater, which is... Uh, Fervor plus three and health gain plus 0 0.01. Cave Sage is plus two wisdom. And then the last word is Philosopher's Stone, which is three wisdom and one, one awareness. You gain a level one every five levels, a tier a talent, one every five levels now. So as you can see right now, I have four talents. I have not spent any of these talents yet. see here what else have they added they have changed and added some new which we don't see here obviously but they've added some new monsters in here they've added spider layers brood mothers and broodlings they've also added some improvements to where they're not getting stuck which I don't think is working. We'll go into in a minute. They've added other different bug fixes and stuff like that with it. As far as anything new, there's not much been added. The overworld, I don't see anything really changed here. Talent tree. Oh, they added this. No, they didn't. Never mind. They just changed the way it looks, I believe. Job broker looks the same. So that's mostly the... That's the main changes that they've done. Like I said, these are some of the new items that are in there. Don't think there's anything else new that has been added. I don't see anything else. No. So as far as the series goes with the 20 Dwarf Challenge, I am having difficulty. The reason why I went back is with the elevators... They're walking on them. As soon as the game starts, they're walking on the elevators, trying to go up and down. They are getting stuck. They are not moving. I'm not sure if because of the changes with the elevators are broken or if that's what they're talking about with the elevators are broken. But on top of it, within about a minute or so, the game will have a fatal error and crash. This has been more stable here. So I don't know if I want to just restart that way we can get the new monsters in here. Or if I want to start from here and work my way back up to where we were. I have to figure that out. Let me know in the comments below what you'd like to see. If you want me to just start over again, I'll speed through getting back up to where we are. I'll probably just get up to the 20 dwarves really quickly and start it there. Hopefully in the first episode or two. Maybe run a couple of longer episodes right at the beginning. But let me know what you want me to do because I'm not going to be able to pick it up where it is. I'm pretty sure it's just a lost cause. I'm going to hope that maybe they come out with some kind of emergency patch in the next day or so. But I'm not sure if that's actually going to happen. Right now, I don't even have Smithy yet that I had. I don't have this full elevator that we had built. So, they seem to be moving okay otherwise, but you know, they're moving across okay otherwise, but they were, I was having a problem like right here, I was trying to build a stone stairway, let's see what happens when I put this here. They were having a problem getting stuck right here, doing kind of like this where they were just getting right here and not moving. So I don't know... If it's just because it's an old map. I know they said they were trying to put in some kind of a fix for old maps. 
to work again, but I not sure if that actually worked. Let's see what happens when I move this person. Oh, so they seem to be moving. Okay. It just appears to be the elevators. I think I know what it is. I've normally put multiple elevator platforms on it so that they can go up and down. I've noticed they can't cross over each other anymore. So that may be what it is. You may be only be able to put one or elevator platform on it and they're just going to have to wait. Yep, so everybody seems to be working, moving okay there. So let me know what your thoughts are. Go ahead and end it here. There's not much else I can do. I've got to think about what I want to do. I have all day tomorrow to be able to figure this out and try to get something put together. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you on the next episode.